What's up guys? Welcome to video number eight of uh, Sun Wind Power Wall Tankering. Well, I finally got my outdoor tankering table far enough along to where as uh, I can take it outside and weld it up. I ain't gonna weld it up in here. I mean, I I don't mind doing a little bit of tack welding in the house, but I'm, I'm not going to actually burn no steel in the house. I'll do that outside. Getting ready to take and uh, throw a coat of paint on the thing. Now, I used half inch water pipe, but it, you know, anybody want to build an outside tinkering table out of one by one pressure treated lumber, I mean, that'd work too. I just went with water pipe because, uh, hey, Beater, what's up, buddy? Yeah, you just want attention, don't you? Because uh, steel lasts just a little bit longer than wood, and I don't care if it is pressure treated. I mean, steel's damn near forever, and wood's for just a minute. You know what I mean? Of course, having said that, you'll notice the tabletop's OSB. <laughs> yeah, I got cheap. <laughs> what the hell can I say, man? Anyways, uh... I'd give y'all an update on how the tankering table's going along, and uh, as soon as I get this thing outside and get all the steel burned, I'll start the fabrication of the lower wheeled section for the por for the portable solar tracking portable solar tracking system. Damn, it took a minute, but I got it out, eh? So. Uh, I guess I'll get up off my butt and let you take a look at the recipe, and which it, which is basically the cut dimensions for for making a pretty little table. Oh, I know you won't go outside, Mr. Bean. You always won't go outside. Yeah, where's the pieces of paper? There they are. Okay, these are the uh, cut dimensions for the table. And these are the cut dimensions for the OSB. Yeah, I think it's going to work pretty good. And I'll be able to throw my materials up on this bad boy. And, and it's, real, it, it's pretty flat, pretty square. I'll be able to take and tack weld everything into place and get it structured pretty well and then take and burn it up. One thing at a time, eh guys? Gotta walk for you and crawl. Now crawl for you and walk. You know what I mean. You know, that's got all I got for the minute, guys. When I get the thing outside and get it welded together and stuff, I'll go ahead and do another another update on the lower half of the tracking system and stuff, the wheeled section, because that's what I got to fab up next. Everything else is pretty much good to go. Of course, it'd be nice to put a coat of paint on everything, too. I, that's not really painted. That's That there is leftovers from one of my other systems. Well, keep on tankering, fellas. Be good. Be good at it. God bless.